Welcome back to Windows Fixer. Today we are tackling a common issues that many of you face. Clipboard functionality problem on Windows. Whether you are trying to copy and paste multiple items or your clipboard just is not working, we have got you covered. In this video, I will guide you through several methods to restore your clipboard functionality including quick fixes and advanced solutions using the registry editor. If you find this video helpful, please like, subscribe and hit the bell icon for more tech tutorials. Before we dive into the solutions, let's briefly understand why clipboard issues occur. The clipboard is a virtual space where Windows temporarily store copied data. Various services manage these functions and sometimes they can encounter problems leading to clipboard malfunctions by tweaking system settings, restarting specific processes or editing the registry. We can resolve these issues and restore full clipboard functionality. In my case, well, while optimizing, somehow I disable this and after restarting, I realized that my clipboard is not working. So let's get started. The step number one, restart Windows Explorer. Let's start with a simple yet effective method. Restarting Windows Explorer, first press Ctrl plus Shift plus ESC to open Task Manager. Once Task Manager is open, locate Windows Explorer in the list of processes. Right click on Windows Explorer and select Restart. This section can refresh the clipboard service and often resolve minor issues. Solution number two, using system 32 folder. Next, we will manually run some crucial process from the system 32 folder. Open file explorer and navigate to the C drive, windows and then system 32 folder. In the search bar type rdpclip.exe. When you find it, right click on it rdpclip.exe and choose run as administrator. This process handles clipboard operations. Now do the same for dwm.exe. Search for it in the same location, right click and choose run as administrator. After running both, restart your computer to ensure the changes take effect. Solution number 3. Use the echo of command on command prompt. If the preview method did not work, let's use a command to clear the clipboard. Search for CMD in the Windows search box, right click on it and run as administrator. In the command prompt Windows, type the following command. I will provide the command in the description so it will be easier for you to simple copy and paste and then press enter. This command clears the clipboard which can help resolve any lingering issues. Solution number 4. Another approach is to reset the clipboard service by ending and restarting its process. In task manager, go to the detail tab and look for the rdpclip.exe service. Right click on rdpclip.exe and select end process. Next, go to the file, run new task and type rdpclip.exe in the dialog box. Then press enter. This will refresh the clipboard service. Solution number 5. Reset the rdpclip.exe process via a command prompt. Alternatively, you can use command prompt to reset the clipboard service. Search for CMD, right click and run it as an administrator. In the command prompt windows, type this command task kill.exe space slash f space slash im space rdpclip.exe I will provide this command in the description so it will be easier for you. To end the rdpclip.exe task, then type rdpclip.exe again and press enter to restart the process. This can help re-establish clipboard functionality. Step number 6. Using registry editor. For a more advanced solution, we can tweak the registry settings to ensure clipboard history is enabled. Search for reg edit in the windows search box and open the registry editor. Navigate to these two locations. I will again provide these locations, these destination in the description so it will be easier for you guys to navigate to the exact location. The first one is HKey local machine, then software, then Microsoft, then clipboard. In the right panel, locate and double click on Is Cloud and History Features Available? Set the value data to 1 and click OK. And number 2, HKey Local Machine, Software, then Policies, then Microsoft, then Windows, then System. Look for Allow Clipboard History and the second Allow Cross Device Clipboard and Enable Activity Feed. Double click each one and set the value data to 1. After making these changes, restart your computer to apply the new settings. And that's it. We have covered multiple methods to fix clipboard issues on Windows. 
from simple restarting to advanced registry edit you now have the tool to get your clipboard back in working order if this video help you please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more tech tips and tutorials do you have any question or other issues you would like me to cover drop a comment below i will be happy to help thanks for watching and i'll see you in the next video bye bye